Hi everybody and thank you so much to Wayne for inviting me to, to speak to you at this meeting. Um, my name is Gabby Wittas, I'm a research fellow at the University of Leicester. I'm based in the Beyond Distance Research Alliance and I'm going to be telling you today about the project um, that I'm working on at the moment called Toucans. More about that in a minute. Toucans is um, supported by the SCORE program with the Open University and funded by the Higher Education Funding Council for England. The Toucans project is all about testing the OERU concept and aspirations within the UK. So it's a national study aimed at finding out how stakeholders in UK higher education feel and think about the concept of the OERU um, and hopefully will also generate some guidelines and frameworks for institutions in the UK that are considering joining the OER 10 network. So the, the questions, the main research questions are around the models and frameworks that OER Tertiary Education Network members are using or planning to use in their participation in the OER University in two specific areas. Firstly, in terms of accreditation of recognition of accreditation from other institutions. So if students um, gather credits from other universities and then come to your institution, how will your institution deal with recognizing those previously acquired credits? And secondly, in the area of student support, how and whether institutions that are participating in the OERU are planning to support their students. Um, those two questions will lead, um, I think, to some kind of an answer to the $500 million question, which is um, what is the business model that enables institutions to participate in this um, this great initiative of making education freely available to people who wouldn't otherwise have access to it. Um, how can that be done in, in a way that, um, that works from a business point of view? So um, once I've gathered some data from existing OER 10 members around these questions, I'll be liaising with stakeholders in UK universities, finding out what their attitudes and perceptions are and hopefully being able to give them some information gathered from existing members as to how the whole model could work. Um, I, here are my contact details and I very much hope that all the signed up members of OER 10 will be willing to make someone available for me to interview them, um, get some answers to these questions, share what they're thinking and how they're planning to, to make this work. Um, I do hope that this will ultimately further the cause of the OERU um, and I look forward to contact with all of you over the coming months. The project ends at the end of June 2012. I will be blogging and um, participating in all the debates and discussions online up until then. Thank you very much.